السلام علیکم آل دا ویئرس یور انسٹرکٹر محمد شہزاد ویلکمز آل آف یو ان دا ایجوکیشن اینڈ ٹریننگ پروگرام ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس آئی ڈو ٹیل یو اباؤٹ مائی کمنگ لیکچرز آن ڈیٹا سینٹر ورچولائزیشن اینڈ سیکیورٹی ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس یو ول ہیو اے سیریز آف لیکچرز on how to design and implement virtualization in the data center. In this series of lectures, you will get to know about the virtualization environment in the data center and you will be able to design and implement virtualization in the data center. And you will get to know about uh, the concept of virtualization in this context. My dear students, uh, you will have a series of lectures on how to connect internet work devices using layer 2 and layer 3 connections in the data center. In this series of lectures, you will get to know about the LAN environment and the WAN environment in the data center. <coughs> Dear students, you will have a series of lectures on managing users and roles in the data center and you will be able to create users and roles and you will be able to assign roles to the users and you will be able to manage security uh, by managing users and roles in the data center and you will do this by configuring users and roles uh, and uh, assigning roles to the users on the nexus switches such as nexus 9000 series nexus 7000 series nexus 5000 series and mds switches <clears throat> dear students you will have a series of lectures on managing vsan database in the data center and you will be able to create and maintain uh, manage vsans in the database Uh, that is known as vsan database and uh, you you will be able to configure vsans uh, in the vsan database of nexus switches such as nexus 9000 series nexus 7000 series nexus 5000 series and mds switches and you will be able Uh, to create and manage vsans in the vsan databases of nexus switches and mds switches my dear students you will have a series of lectures on planning and implementing vlans and vsans strategies in the data center My dear students, uh, you will have a series of lectures on planning and implementing VTP strategies in the data center. VTP stands for VLAN Trunking Protocol. In this series of lectures, uh, you will learn about VLAN Trunking Protocol that how does a VTP work and how you can design plan and implement vtp strategies in the data center dear students you will have a series of lectures on designing and implementing fabric path in the data center in this series of lectures you will get to know about the fabric path what is meant by a fabric path why does it being used 
and how to implement the fabric path on nexus switches uh, in the data center environment my dear students you will have a series of lectures uh, on connecting inter network devices such as nexus switches and mds switches and you will get to know uh, about how to connect nexus switches and mds switches with each other over fc over ethernet connection in the data center my dear students uh, you will have a series of lectures uh, in these lectures you will get to know how to connect inter network devices such as uh, nexus switches and mds switches and you will get to know about how to connect nexus switches and uh, mds switches over fc connection in the data center my dear students you will get to know about uh, how to connect mds switches over fiber channel over ip connection in the data center my dear students you will have a series of lectures on managing access controls and security in the data center in the access controls and security you will learn about acls and advanced topic of uh, acl that is expanded acl that is expanded access control list and for uh, managing access controls and security you will learn advanced topics uh, that are comprised on designing and implementing triple a authentication using ta ca c plus server and radius server and uh, my dear students uh, you will have a series of lectures on managing high availability in the data center and you will be able to manage high availability in the data center using different redundancy protocols that provides redundancy and security uh, these redundancy protocols uh, that are uh, hsrp protocol vrrp protocol and glbp protocols you will be able to manage high availability in the data center using these uh, redundancy protocols such as hsrp protocol vrrp protocol and glbp protocol dear students uh, you will have a series of lectures on designing and implementing routing protocols in the data center using different routing protocols such as rip protocol eigrp protocol osp f protocol bgp protocol and in this series of lectures you will have an advanced topic uh that is working with advanced bgp using uh bgp templates such as bgp session template bgp peer policy template and bgp peer template and you will learn how to implement and configure uh, and manage these protocols such as rip uh, eigrp ospf and bgp protocols on nexus switches and mds switches my dear students uh, i think so you might uh, be very happy to learn about my coming lectures on 
data center uh, virtualization and security and uh, routing protocols uh, in the data center that are the advanced topics in the uh, advanced computer networks and network security you might be learning at uh, uh, ms level or phd level i think so um, you uh, you will be very excited inshallah uh, soon i will be with you uh, with the next video on virtualization in the data center till then i see you allah face